Ever wondered why we feel hot-headed when we're trying to solve a tough problem? Well, there's a scientific reason why that happens. When our brain gets busy, be it during a challenging math problem or a heated debate, it starts to warm up. This is because our brain, the powerhouse of the body, increases its metabolic activity in response to the task at hand. You see, our brains aren't like the rest of our body. While our body maintains a steady temperature of around 96.8 degrees Fahrenheit, our brain can heat up to a whopping 104 degrees Fahrenheit when it's hard at work. That's a significant increase. This process is crucial for our brain to function optimally and for us to perform at our best. So next time you're thinking hard, remember your brain is literally heating up. Did you know your brain is an energy hog? Yes, this compact organ, which accounts for only about 2% of your body's weight, is quite the powerhouse. Despite its relatively small size, it's a glutton for resources, consuming a whopping 20% of your body's total energy and oxygen intake. Think of it this way, your brain is like the CEO of a large corporation. While it might not take up much space in the grand scheme of things, it's calling the shots, making crucial decisions and overseeing the operations of the entire organization. And to do that, it needs a significant amount of energy. So every time you're solving a puzzle, learning a new skill or even daydreaming, your brain is working overtime, guzzling energy and oxygen to keep all those mental cogs turning efficiently, and it doesn't clock off. It's working round the clock, even when you're sleeping. So, when you're thinking, you're really burning some serious energy? Ever felt fuzzy-brained when you're thirsty? Well, there's a scientific reason for that. Our brains are actually made up of about 73% water. That's right, almost three quarters of your brain is just water. Now, imagine what happens when you're not drinking enough fluids. Even a small 2% drop in your body's water content can start to impact your attention, memory, and other cognitive skills. It's like trying to run a car without enough oil. It might still work, but it's not going to run smoothly. And just like your car, your brain needs regular top-ups to stay in peak condition. That's why it's so important to keep drinking water throughout the day, especially in hot weather or when you're exercising. So the next time you're reaching for that third cup of coffee, maybe consider a glass of water instead. So stay hydrated to keep your brain sharp. Did you know that sweating can make your brain shrink? That's right folks. A study has found that just 90 minutes of sweating can temporarily shrink the brain as much as one year of aging. Surprised? Let's delve into it. Your body loses water when you sweat. This leads to dehydration, which in turn can affect your brain. The brain, being about 73% water, is highly sensitive to changes in body hydration levels. A drop of just 2% can impact attention, memory, and other cognitive skills. So imagine what a heavy sweat session could do. When you sweat for about 90 minutes, your brain can experience a level of shrinkage equivalent to the natural aging process of a year. This shrinkage, however, is temporary and can be reversed by rehydration. So, don't worry the gym isn't making you age faster, it's just a reminder to keep your water bottle handy. Remember that the next time you're sweating it out at the gym? Did you ever wonder what makes us learn and adapt? It's all about the neurons and synapses in our brains. Imagine the brain as a bustling city, with about 100 billion inhabitants. These are your neurons. Each neuron is like an information processing center, constantly receiving, analyzing, and transmitting information. But how do these neurons communicate? Enter synapses. Synapses are like bridges between neurons, allowing them to pass messages to one another. Picture each neuron connected to hundreds or even thousands of others through these synapses. This intricate network is what enables us to learn and adapt to new situations. Every time you pick up a new skill, you're not just learning. You're constructing new bridges, creating new pathways in your brain. This constant change and adaptation is what keeps our brains active and healthy. So, every time you learn something new, you're literally making new connections in your brain. Ever felt overwhelmed by all your thoughts? You're not alone in this. It's quite the norm, given the remarkable capabilities of the human brain. You see, it's like a bustling city with a population of thoughts that's off the charts. On an average day, it's estimated that the human brain produces around 70,000 thoughts. That's right, 70,000. This constant stream of thoughts might seem like a lot, but it's simply a testament to the brain's incredible processing power. When you're thinking about what to have for breakfast, contemplating the universe's mysteries, or even just daydreaming, your brain is working tirelessly, churning out thousands of thoughts. It's like a thought factory working 24-7, producing thoughts of all shapes and sizes. This is why it's crucial to give your brain the rest it needs through relaxation and sleep. 
Remember, it's not about silencing your thoughts but understanding and managing them. So, it's quite normal to have a busy mind, it's just your brain doing its job. Did you know your brain is a world traveler? That's right. Concealed beneath your skull is a vast network of blood vessels that if stretched out would measure roughly 100,000 miles. That's enough to circle the earth not once, not twice, but approximately four times. This intricate labyrinth of vessels plays a crucial role in keeping your brain healthy and functioning at its best. They supply oxygen and essential nutrients to every nook and cranny of your brain, powering your thoughts, your dreams, your memories, and so much more. Despite their delicate nature, these vessels are incredibly resilient, adapting and growing throughout your lifetime. They ensure that every part of your brain gets exactly what it needs, when it needs it. So, next time you're marveling at the wonders of the world, spare a thought for the incredible journey happening inside your own head. So, your brain is more well-traveled than you might have thought. Ever heard of the term, gray matter? It's not just a fancy phrase we use to describe smart people. It's actually an integral part of our brains. The brain contains an astounding 100 billion neurons, collectively referred to as the gray matter. Each of these neurons is a powerhouse of information processing, making sense of the world around us and helping us navigate our daily lives. Picture this, if each neuron was a person, the population would surpass the total number of humans on Earth by more than 10 times. These neurons aren't isolated though, they're constantly communicating sending and receiving signals in a rapid-fire exchange of information. This intricate network is the foundation of our thoughts, feelings, and perceptions. So next time you're faced with a complex problem or a challenging decision, remember the incredible gray matter at work in your brain. So, when someone compliments your gray matter, they're praising your brains. Did you know your brain is a galaxy? Yes, you heard that right. Just like the Milky Way galaxy that holds countless stars, your brain is home to an astoundingly large number of neurons. This might sound like a hyperbole, but it's entirely true. Within that sophisticated structure of your brain, there are approximately 100 billion neurons. Now let's put that into perspective. The Milky Way, our home galaxy, is estimated to contain somewhere between 100 to 400 billion stars. Each neuron in your brain, like a star in the galaxy, is a tiny powerhouse, transmitting information through electrical and chemical signals. Linked through synapses, these neurons form complex networks, enabling you to think, learn, and adapt. So, when you're pondering the mysteries of the universe, remember there's a comparable universe right there in your head. A complex network of neurons firing away, making you who you are. So, you literally have a galaxy in your head. Did you know that the brain has been a mystery throughout history? For centuries, the human brain has been a source of intrigue and fascination. It's been misunderstood, misinterpreted, and shrouded in myths. From ancient civilizations attributing mental phenomena to the heart, to the medieval belief in the four humors, we've come a long way. In the late 19th century, phrenology, the study of the shape and size of the cranium as a supposed indication of character and mental abilities, was all the rage. It was later debunked as pseudoscience but not before it had been widely accepted. Even in the 20th century we held on to misconceptions. For example, the idea that we only use 10% of our brains is still prevalent today, despite being thoroughly disproved by modern neuroscience. So, even though we've learned a lot about the brain, it still holds many mysteries for us to uncover.